Welcome to the VX Flex Demonstration Lab. VX Flex OS is a software defined storage product that creates a server based storage area network. It converts direct attached storage into shared block storage. VX Flex OS is sold as a software only or pre installed on Dell EMC VX Flex ready nodes. The following demonstration will show how to deploy VX Flex OS in VSphere 6.5. First, you'll need to download the complete software from EMC's support site. The next step is to deploy the VX Flex plugin through PowerCLI. When prompt, enter vSender IP and credentials. Then select option 1 to register the plugin. Next select option 3 to deploy the SVM template. Provide the OVA location when prompted, then press enter. Enter the data store name where the template will be deployed. Now let's open the vCenter web client and run the vPlex OS plugin. Select pre deployment actions. Select all hosts you'd like the SDC installed. The SDC is the client portion of vFlex OS. This action will install the proper driver in the selected host. Leave configure direct path and convert ISO unchecked. Now click deploy vxflex OS environment link. Enter a system name and choose a password for the admin user. Now select the vCenter host to be added to the VXFlex system. Select the ESXi host for the VXFlex OS components. Skip this optional step. Add a new protection domain. Add a new storage pool. Skip this optional step. Select the ESXs to add to the SDS to the VFlex OS. The SDS is the data server portion in VXFlex OS. Select at least one drive on each host that will be used for data storage. Now select which host can access the VFlex OS system. Select where the VXFlex OS gateway will be deployed. The gateway is used to collect logs and upgrade components. While the LIA enables communication between all components. Now select the template we have previously deployed. It will be used to deploy all SDS and Gateway VMs. Next, choose the Management and Data Network. In this demonstration lab, we will be using a single network for both management and data. Please note that separate networks are recommended for a real production deployment. Now let's define IPs for our virtual machines. We are now ready to start the automatic deployment. This step will take around 45 minutes to complete.
If any errors occur during the installation process, you can view the logs to identify what went wrong. At this point, verify that the SDC clients are connected. Next, let's click on Storage Pools. Click on Create Volume. In this window, we will create a small 8GB volume that will be used as a data store on our host. Choose the vSphere host where this volume will be available. The new volume is now available as a SCSI device on the host. Let's create a data store on that device now. That's it, the new data store is now created and mounted on all hosts. This completes the VX Flex OS demonstration lab. And as always, thank you for watching.